Not only do you both share love for who your partner is, you also love who they will become, loving the qualities you each bring to the relationship and the aspects of your bond you have yet even to discover. While today is truly a joyous and wonderful day in your lives, we know it's not the beginning of your lives together, rather a natural outgrowth, a continuation of the love and devotion to each other you have shared, committed to, cultivated, and that you lift up. Jeffrey, I'm so excited for this day. We've waited so long. So I can't wait to see you, and I love you so very much. I can't wait to see you at the altar. Oh, sweetheart. You look more beautiful than I ever thought. I love you so much. You look great. Thanks. You gonna be all right? Yep. Okay. Nothing came out, so we're all right. <laughs> you look terrific. Hey, Sarah. Uh, you know, just a few hours. Uh, you know, finally gonna call you my wife. Uh, it's been a hell of a journey so far, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. It's you know, we've been waiting so long, preparing for this day, and it's finally here. So it's. Uh, I, I, I'm excited to spend the rest of my life with my best friend and with someone that understands me and everything that knows me inside and out. And I love you to the moon and back. Sarah, you are the love of my life, my best friend, and you've always been there for me when I've needed you most. I'll always be there for you through thick and thin, through good times and the bad. I'll always be by your side. With all of our stupid little jokes to being in your presence, you make me want to be the best version of myself so I can love you unconditionally for the rest of my days. I love you to the moon and back. And I don't know where I would be without you. You stole my heart that day in marching band when you complimented me on my talents as color guard. And from that day forward, the compliments have continued. I felt the same way about you for nine years, and I look forward to the years to come as your wife. I vow to be patient, supportive, faithful, and respectful. I vow to love and cherish every moment with you as my husband. I love you. I can't wait to grow old together. So we fall more in love with each other every day and continue to be connected in every way as long as we both shall live. I'm proud to become your wife and ecstatic to start this next chapter in our lives. The best love is the kind that awakens the soul and makes us reach for more that plants a fire in our hearts and brings peace to our minds. And so my hope for the newlyweds is that you both continue to awaken each other's souls and keep building the fire in your hearts. May God bless your marriage and may you have many years of love and happiness together. In all seriousness, among those who know Sarah uh, will know she's a wonderful and caring person and she deserves a good husband. Thank God Jeff married her first. Um, but in all honesty, I do believe in the love between Sarah and Jeff, and they're, you know, they're special. And that's what I've got. So, cheers to the two of them. When I met Jeff, I thought he was a big phony. Because he was way too nice, way too nice. And I 
talked to my daughter and she was she was in love with him from first sight and it it was obvious as the years went by that uh, he's genuine he treats her better than i do It has been said that we break a glass on the joyous occasion of the wedding to remind us that the world is still to be perfected. And our prayer is that this couple helps to perfect it. Oh, one more time. Mazel tov! Give me a kiss. <laughs>